What's up gang? Welcome and welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Hrizi and I'm back at it again with another video. Thank you so much for tuning in. If you're new here, please feel free to hit that subscribe button. And if you're my day one subscriber, I got mad, mad, mad respect for you. So as you can tell by the title, I'll be plugging you guys, especially for those who've been like afraid to order from Sheen. Like I know I've been there, especially with the customs trauma and the shipping trauma and don't don't like so before we get into the video, let us bang the intro. So guys, I'm about to give you the trick, the tea on how to dodge Sheen Customs. They can be a nightmare. They can be the biggest nightmare. So I ordered for the first time and I was shook that I didn't pay customs. No, actually not the first time, but like the past three orders. So the first order of those three orders, I was shook to not have to not be paying custom custom because I was home that time and I'm getting calls, Uguti, your delivery, and in my mind I'm like I'm waiting for the customs message. I didn't get the customs message. I'm like cool. So the second time around, I'm like okay, I'm gonna do a trick again. I'm gonna do it again. I need to order for the second time. I ordered same thing and i'm like you know what let me order for the last time <laughs> let me order for the last time so that i can like just make sure am i really not paying customs am i really not paying customs girl went ahead and ordered for the third time i ordered and boom i got that message cleared from customs hey i was really happy and i was like yeah no mm -mm. <laughs> you're like this is how i'll be i'll be going from now on i wasn't paying shipping at all so no customs no shipping when you're thinking of ordering from sheen now and you're thinking of going small that's good but if you want to buy orders with two thousand rand or three thousand rand then honey you're gonna have to split it you are going to have to split it and the most important thing is that your order each and every order should not be more than 1099 rand ever so my orders have been like costing me like 1070 1080 somewhere there excluding the bank charge the bank charges because you know that the bank charges can be a bit steep but never let your order exceed 1099 rand Ran. and you know that in the app um once you add your 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 clothes or whatever it is that you'll be purchasing onto your card it will tell you that you need a hundred rand more to qualify for free shipping and then quite no okay and you'd be happy oh my order is not over 1900 rand and then you have discount and you have points and then you apply your discount once you apply your discount and then you decide oh i have points let me just apply my points too and then boom they charge you shipping and then they tell you you need to purchase maybe i get 40 rand or 60 rand more to qualify for free shipping one more time and then you're gonna go back to your card make sure hey you need to make sure <laughs> i don't know how to stress this like make it balance you're gonna try to make it balance but make sure that you go back and add one more product that's worth that amount maybe it will fit like a 40 rand i put it in the games maybe it will fit like a two rand but i'm not getting maybe it's gonna be more than 20 rand it doesn't matter it doesn't matter as long as you qualify for free shipping and your order is not over 1099 rand so i feel i'm not sure i just that's what i feel i feel like the weight of your package also contrib contributes to the criteria i don't know how they calculated but i feel like the weight also contributes i need to tell you guys that for the past three orders they've been hand they've been handled by aramax i don't know with regards to buffalo logistics i do not know but i'm gonna order one more time and if my order is shipped by buffalo logistics and they charge me customs i'm just gonna i'll edit the description box or the comment section but i'll, I'll update you guys also the words that no one no one ever wants to hear are 
there is a possibility that you will be charged customs so if you take my tip and they charge you custom please don't come at me <laughs> don't come at me it has been working for me and i'm gonna continue to use this tip so that's it guys let me know if this worked out for you i'll see you guys in my next video bye